Hello friends, today is going to be a very quick YouTube video. I'm going to be showing you how to get rid of that green outline that surrounds your 2D VTuber from PRPR Live's green screen. So we're gonna do it in Streamlabs first and then OBS, so let's get started. All right, so first, if you don't have your avatar in here, what you would do is go ahead and click a plus. You do a game capture here and you do a new source and I'm going to select a specific window. We're gonna allow transparency and add PRPR Live. So there it is right there. Now we see this really gross green outline that's around our character. We can also zoom Zoom in and PR PR live by holding alt scroll wheel. There's a really nasty green outline that nobody wants to see because it totally ruins the aesthetic of your VTuber. So what we're going to do is you're just going to right click on that game capture. You're going to go to filters and then you're going to add one and add one called color key. So we'll add color key here, click done. And what you're going to do is turn up the similarity until that green outline goes away. So now you can see there is no more green outline. So it's going to be a little bit different for every person's VTuber. You might want to mess with some of this stuff. I honestly actually you think just I just messed it up so I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna reset that so you can just turn up the similarity there's some other settings too if you wanted to mess with those but the more you turn up the similarity it should start getting rid of the green outline you might not be able to get it perfect but just mess around with some of these settings here and see if you can get rid of that green outline so I got rid of most of mine this avatar wasn't as cleanly made as my new one and not all the green outline is gone currently with that but again mess around with those settings and see what you could do it should work pretty well for your VTuber. I'm going to show you another version of how to get this fixed with another avatar. This is for Briggs. He's an anime YouTuber. I worked on this commission for him. So as you can see in here, if I turn off the color key, there is that gross green outline. Again, very subtle, but enough to be annoying. You can see it over here as well. And then we allow that color key to turn on and now we have that green outline gone. So that should solve most of your green outline problems. There's some other things you can do as far as green screen to try and get rid of that, but that should be pretty good. Now let's hop over into OBS so I can show you how to do it over there as well. All right, so now we're over in OBS Studio. We're going to do a plus to get up, uh, do game capture, VR, I'm just gonna say, okay, we're gonna do again, specific window. We're going to choose PR, PR Live, allow transparency, good. So we still have that green outline around everything as you can see, gross. We're going to add a filter, right click the VR filter. We're gonna go plus, you're gonna do color key, okay. And then we're gonna turn up our similarity until it's gone. And there we go, it is now pretty clean. Hopefully that helps you out. Get rid of your green screen problem. Unfortunately, my lip tracking just decided to not work anymore. So uh, here we are. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys are interested in learning how to make your own 2D VTuber, I have a huge long tutorial series going on right now. I will drop the links below to that whole series to each video that's out at this current moment. And also there'll be a card up above to the very first video that talks to you about how to cut up layers for how to become a 2D VTuber. Also, if you're not in our Discord, you should totally join. There's a ton of VTubers over there. It's a lot of fun. We got a lot of friends and you could share your art as well and share your progress. Anyways, I'll see you on the next video. Have a lovely rest of your day, Gem, and remember to shine brightly. Bye.